Alongside the rallying at the US Open, we have our very own crypto rally. Bitcoin.com announces its own crypto exchange. And inside the ECB, we have a non-believer. Following a less than great week, the crypto market recovered nicely. Like a greasy fry up after one too many the night before, you're still not out of the woods, but you can imagine that you might be at some point. The total market cap broke the key 250 billion resistance. Bitcoin climbed above the 10,400 US dollar mark, and my old mate, Chang Peng, will be happy as the Binance coin we spoke about last time is also gaining momentum, breaking the 2250 resistance. Hopefully more gains will be seen across the board and we continue our march forward. Bitcoin.com, who did well to get that domain name, and they also mainly focus on covering Bitcoin, so it kind of makes sense to have such a name. Names aside, the reason we are talking about them is that they are launching their own digital assets exchange. They will host a range of trading pairs, including the most popular cryptocurrencies. They hope to compete with the likes of Coinbase and Binance. I think they'll struggle against Changpeng, but that's just me. They are being very nice to get you on board as well, saying that new accounts will get paid to trade by benefiting from negative 0.3% trading fees for the next three months. Not too shabby. We have a non-believer in the EU. What? We seem to be obsessed with Facebook's Libra at the moment, so why not talk about it some more? It's not the US government that is skeptical this time though. We have an ECB executive board member who is less than impressed. Eve Mersch has some real concerns about the running of Libra, claiming it's not a real cryptocurrency. He added that Calibra, the group managing Libra, are owned by Facebook. So although they stated that they would not be involved, the social media king is still likely to have full control over the ecosystem. So much for decentralization. Perhaps we need a slight rethink, Mark. While you're here, why not check out the world's first cryptocurrency by a Swiss bank? Dukascoin.com has all the info you need. Go check it out. The Honey Badger Conference is coming up on the 14th and 15th of September. Dukascobi TV will be there to give you all the info you could ever need from all of the experts. Go check out their website. Thanks for watching. See you next time.